Hello ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children of all ages, Viking Guitar here, and today we're going to go over another uh, little little Reaper trick. Um, this is a bit more isolated uh, usage than the last one, but still something very helpful. Um, and the question comes from a Facebook post I saw in an audio group, which asks, how do you um, create regions from multiple items? Um, specifically, is there an easy way to create a region per item when you have a whole buttload of items? Um, so for this, what we're going to do is uh, we're going to import the entirety of my Legion album as MP3s, um, and we're going to do it on a single track. And so this represents a buttload of items. Now, this this will work whether you have eight like there are here or two or, you know, a thousand or whatever. Um, but basically, as you can see, each one of these is a separate item. So and as you can see, they're also brick walled like crazy because whatever. Anyway, that's not the point. So what you're going to do is go into options, preferences on the left under general keyboard multi-touch, assign keyboard shortcuts. This is an incredible tool in Reaper if you don't know about it. Um, this lets you assign keyboard shortcuts to pretty much every action in Reaper. And also, um, even if you don't want a keyboard shortcut, it, it helps you find a lot of the things that are there, um, even if you just have kind of a rough idea. So for this, if you just type the word region into the filter up here, you're going to see a lot of options related to regions. And the one in particular that we want is insert separate regions for each selected item. Now I went ahead and I mapped this to the control alt shift plus I uh, key command. But even if you don't want to map it to a command, you can just hit run and it will do it. So what we're going to do is uh, go back. We're going to select all of these. We're going to go back into preferences, open that again. And just to close that out so we can see here, uh, region, as I click on this and then hit this run button down here, bam. We now have separate regions for each separate item. And they are specifically to the starting and end points. They don't overlap. And if we go look at our region marker uh, matrix here, manager, we've got everything right there. So once again, that's under options, preferences, keyboard multi-touch, assign keyboard shortcuts, just punch in region. And what you want to look for is markers, insert separate regions for each selected item. Um, another thing you could do is insert region from selected items, which would create one region that encompasses um, any that you have highlighted at the time. So you could highlight items one, two, and three, use this function, and it would create one region that covers one, two, and three. Um, but if, you're, if you've imported like a whole bunch of different uh, little audio files, and let's say you want to do one um, master bus effect to it and then render them all, and uh, an easy way to do that is by having each one its own region, and that's the way you do it. So there it is. Once again, I'm Viking Guitar. Thanks for watching. Keep Reaper metal. Keep the world metal. Um, check out my website if you need any uh, composing or audio production, any of that stuff. www.vikingguitar.com. And that's it.